Okay, y'all, this is Mark Johnson of PressFem.com, and uh, what we're going to do today is we're going to look at how to use denoise in Adobe CS5. Okay, so to do this, we are going to, here's a little sample video of mine. I'm using my actress, or an actress, not my actress. Her name is Katarina. She was in my film, The Beautiful Bleeding, uh, which is also on YouTube. Uh, great actress. Uh, I'm going to use her for this example, okay? So let's <clears throat> minimize her a little bit. And um, <clears throat> we're going to go to our effects. So let's do this from the beginning, okay? So what we're going to do, um, first of all, you need to make sure that you have your effects, uh, effects window open here. And to do that, you go to Window and make sure Effects is checked. Okay, you're also going to want your effects control. Uh, mine's is already here. If you don't see it, uh, make sure it's check marked here and um, then you're good to go. Okay, so of course you're going to import your clip. You go to File, Import, and find your clip wherever it may be. And you select it. Then you're going to drag, once the clip shows up, you're going to drag it into your project, which I've already done. So from here, into your project. Okay, so now what you're going to do is um, listen to your clip. Well, what actor inspires you the most? Actor or actress? They're all called actors nowadays anyway. Yeah. Or it's just something you fell into, you're not really into... Okay, we don't need to hear so much of that anyway. <clears throat> um, the point is, it's there, and um, there's a little hiss. You might not notice it from your computer, but I can notice it from mine. And uh, You want to use denoise to get rid of a lot of that background noise and background hiss sometimes, okay? So we're going to go to Audio Effects, which is right here in the Effects menu. You're going to click it, and you're going to scroll down until you see denoiser. You're going to grab this denoiser and you're going to drag and drop it onto the audio of this clip. All right, the visual is at the top, video at top, audio at the bottom. Okay, so now that you have that drag there, you're going to go to uh, effects controls. You're going to scroll down until you see denoiser right here. This is the same thing you just dragged and dropped and it shows up in effects controls. Okay, you're going to go to custom setup because you want to be able to tune it the way you want. And don't go too far because if you go too far, for some reason it disappears. So you might have to drag this up a little bit here. And um, you're going to apply it the way you want to apply it. And these are your parameters here. You, you decide the settings. And once you decide the settings, it'll automatically apply to the audio once you press, uh, press play. Well, what actor inspires you the most? Actor or actress? They're all called actors nowadays anyway. Yeah. Or is it just something you fell into, you're not really into? See, I was playing with the controls as we were speaking, and you might not have noticed the difference from what you're hearing on your speakers now, but if obviously you were editing your own audio, you'd be definitely able to tell the difference. Okay, so that's how you apply denoise to your audio in a video in Adobe CS5. Okay, and for whatever reason, if you decide you don't want the denoiser anymore, or it's just not working the way you like, just click on it and delete it and it's no longer applied to the audio, okay? All right, so this is Mark Johnson, PressFame.com. I hope the tutorial, uh, you learned something from the tutorial, something real quick, and uh, I'm going to do a few of these just to see how they go. Any comments or questions you have, I'm no pro here. I'm just kind of learning as I go, and I just want to share as I learn. All right, thank you.